Hello, and welcome to this next edition of Let's Play World of Warcraft, The Raiding Chronicles. Uh, these are going to be me chronicling my raids, as I said in the uh, Flame Leviathan video, and tonight we're on XD002. Uh, this fight requires two tanks, two healers, sometimes three. I like to bring in two. Uh, two tanks. One is the main tank. Second is for off-tank on ads. I'll get to that later. Three abilities he's going to cast. First one, Light Bomb there. Thing causes AoE damage to you and anyone near you, so if you get that, run away. That guy didn't know how to. Uh, second ability he's going to cast is called Gravity Bomb. That thing doesn't do damage first off, but... Uh, yeah, if it ticks away and you're near anybody, like 10 yards, you're going to pull them all to you and you're all going to take damage. Third ability he's got there is called, I call it Tantrum, but he basically earthquakes the ground. Uh, causes damage to everyone, especially bad if you've got a light bomb on you. You're going to need constant healing, so just remember that. Healers, remember that. Uh, light bomb plus Tantrum equals constant healing. Okay, right now we hit the uh, heart phase. This is generally when shamans blow heroism. Uh, heart fa during the heart phase, his heart leaks energy and spawns adds. His heart also takes 100% more damage, and that is passed on to XT. Now, you can kill the heart for a hard mode, but we don't do that here. Okay, on to the adds. Right here, we have two type three types of adds. I'm going to go into them one by one. First up is the scrap bots. They look like little toys. Uh, scrap bots, if they reach him, they're going to heal him for a bit, so you don't want those to reach him. The way to take those down is to hit the bomb bots. Bomb bots, if you take those down, cause enough AOE damage that they take down all the scrap bots at once. Now, some of the scrap bots might not be close enough to the bomb, so you still got to watch out for those. I did not do a very good job in this one, but eh, it's all good. Pummelers. Uh, they're going to need to be off tank. They can't be on the tank and be him be on XT at the same time. So, that's why you need your off tank. If you notice there, we kind of went simultaneously between heart phase 1 and 2. Heart phases come up on 75% health, 50% health, and 25% health. That's generally why people blow heroism early on, so they can completely bypass a phase of the fight and just go on straight to the heart. As you can see here, I am still trying to get these. I don't recommend you do what I do, uh, which is kind of a trying to AOE them all down. I recommend just staying on the boss, destroying or staying on the bomb, destroying the bomb, it'll take everything out with it, don't worry about that. Well, almost everything, as you can see right there. <clears throat> Anyways, yes, we're about to get into the third heart phase. Uh, got us out of that tantrum. Ooh, that's good. And I didn't notice that these kept spawning, so if you're put on bomb duty or add duty, just keep watching, don't worry about the boss, other people will get that. Stay on the adds, that's what I highly recommend, because... I'm not used to DPSing. I usually heal in game, but we had enough healers that they asked me to go DPS, so I did. <clears throat> Anyways, yeah, this is pretty much the fight. Uh, as you can see, we almost get the speed kill. If I hadn't let a couple of those mods through, then we could have gotten it, but it's all good. It's all good, yeah. So anyways, I hope you all enjoyed this video. Uh, comment, rate, subscribe. And thank you for watching. As you can see, he was on his last legs, and he's down. Anyways, again, thank you for watching. Comment, rate, subscribe.